Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. This is the one and only To Kyla Diary. <laughs> If you're not really here to hear this, see this, feel this, you could go ahead and click off and I'll wait. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I think they're gone. And for my real ones who stay, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, notification bell to get notified every time I post a new video, post a new vlog, or subscriber story time. So if you haven't already sent your subscriber story time, go ahead and send that subscriber story time at that email down below, also in the description box below. And go follow me on all my social media platforms, Instagram, I am underscore Dari to Kyla. Facebook, Snapchat, TikTok, and Twitter is Adari to Kyla. Go ahead and show your girls some love or whatever. So y'all, once again, thank y'all for tuning in for today's video. Let's just jump straight into the story because, child, what a day, what a day, what a day. This was about four years ago, my sophomore year of high school, I believe. Yeah, it was my sophomore year of high school. So if you don't remember these people, I talked about them before in one of my story times, but their story time doesn't matter right now. So remember Destiny? So yeah, Destiny had a sister. Destiny's sister at this time was throwing a kickback at her house. Destiny's sister was trying to let us promote it and stuff. She wanted us to be the party promoters and stuff. So <clears throat> I didn't know nothing about this dang on party until I came to school and Destiny came into my locker and was like, Dari, my sister said she's looking for party promoters for her party that she's throwing. It's like a little kickback. It's going to turn into a party. She's going to have food, drinks, liquor, all type of shit. So um, she said, do you want to be a party promoter? And this day, I was not in the freaking mood to be talking. Like, I was just so uptight this day because, first off, the I was talking to pissed me off. And then, like, I didn't want to be at school this early. Like, I think I, I think I had to be there, like, 7. I did not want to be there that early. So, I was a little irritated going to school. And her talking to me, it kind of, like, I was just, like, out of there. So, she told me that, and I'm just, like, I'll think about it. And I, like, just walked off because... I'm not trying to rub my energy off on you or, you know, be a bitch or nothing like that. So I'm going to just exclude myself and I say, I'm going to let you know. So once I walked off and I told her, I'm going to let her know. When I was on my way to class, I ended up seeing Camila. So if y'all don't remember Camila, that was my girl. You know, she cool, whatever. So I ended up seeing Camila. Camila was walking with um Kaya. So they walking past my class as I'm going to class. And they was like, Adari, Adari. And I'm just like, yeah. yeah. Like, I just said, yeah, like, just like that. And I'm like, yeah. They it was like, you trying to come to the party? You trying to come to the party? You want a party? And I'm like, girl, I told Des I told Destiny already, like, I'll see you. Like, I ain't too big of a, whoo, yeah, I'll go type of girl. Like, yeah, I'll probably come, most likely nine times out of ten. But, like, right now, I am not in the mood to be answering if I want to come or not. Because in the mood I'm in, I don't feel like I want to come. But I'm going to think about it. You feel me? So I told them, like, I'll see you. I'll see you. So Camila was like, Dari, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? And I'm like, nothing wrong with me for real. Like, I'm just not in the mood today to be talking, to be seeing anybody, to be walking, to be hearing. Like, that boy used to piss me off so bad. It, it low-key affected my whole day. Like, if he pissed me off in the morning, I'm going to be pissed off through the whole day because that's just how long I used to hang on and stuff. So I'm telling them, like, yeah, I ain't in the mood today. I ain't really trying to kick it. Blah, 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 blah. So they're like, mm, I guess, like, uh, let us know if you want to come to the party. So I'm like, okay, I'll let you know. Cool, cool. So um, I end up finished walking to class. I go inside my class. The teacher asking me why I'm late. Get that bitch out of here. The first thing I do when I walk in this class is get asked by the teacher why I'm late to class. I'm here? Like, I was just so out of it. So I'm like, I'm here. I made it. It doesn't matter why I'm late to class. So my teacher talk about go get a tardy slip. I'm like, I'm not going nowhere. If I go leave this class, I'm not coming back. I ain't going to lie. So my teacher was like, um, okay, I'm going to call security. Like, this escalated so fast after me just coming to class late and then she telling me to go get a tardy and I didn't want to go get a tardy. Why you can't just write it down in your freaking attendance list that I was tardy? Like, dang, you just, she wanted to make my life harder this day. So I'm like, I ain't going to lie. Like, you tell me to leave this class, baby, I ain't coming back. It's just gonna be like that. So she was like, I'm gonna call security. So I'm like, okay, that's fine. She 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 called security on that thing on walkie talkie and I left. I didn't even wait for security to get there. I just walked out of class. Like I literally was in class for like five minutes and I walked straight back out. So she had me messed up. So I walk out, I go to the bathroom like around the corner on the opposite side of my classroom because if I'm on a 
bathroom on the side of the class, they could easily go check that bathroom and say, okay, a daughter's in there. Yes, she ditching class, blah, 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 blah. So, no, I went to the bathroom on the other side by the lockers. So, I'm over here in the bathroom. I'm walking there. I'm walking there. I walk into a group of girls who, who smoking in the bathroom. Like, I don't smoke. I don't snitch either. So, I'm walking in, and I'm walking, like, straight through the middle of the smoke. So, I'm walking through the middle of the smoke. They blowing that shit in the air and shit. So I say, what the fuck? What the fuck? Like, come on, like, y'all could do that in the stall or something. Y'all do it smack there in the where you wash your hands at. Like, y'all could do that somewhere else. So they was like, my bad. They was like, Asian or something. I don't know what they, I don't know what race they was. But they was like, my bad, my bad. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Is security coming? Security coming? I'm like, nah, but they was coming to my classroom on the other side of the building. So they on this slow somewhere. So they like, all right, thank you, thank you, thank you. So they do this. Try to take the smoke down. So at this point, I smell like the dang old smoke that I just walked into. So now I'm mad too. Because now people finna think I'm smoking. I already just this class. I'm already on the lookout. They already looking out for me. They, I'm looking out for them. I didn't get authority. She finna mark me absent. It's just a lot going on in this hour of school that I just got here. And it's just a lot. I'm in the bathroom. I'm chilling in the bathroom. I had told uh, Destiny to come in the bathroom because I didn't want to be in there by myself. I was just low key lonely as hell. So I tell Destiny to come to the bathroom with me so I can have something to do. So I don't be sitting here by myself. So Destiny came to the bathroom and we just talking or whatever. She telling me about this damn party again. That's the last thing I want to hear about right now. Like, I ain't gonna lie. Like, I don't care about this damn party right now. So I'm telling her, like, Destiny, stop talking about this party, bro. Ask me, ask me something else. Talk me, talk to me about something else. Like, something else. I ain't really fuck with this party situation. So she was like, you good? Like, something happened? Like, why you not mess with the party situation? Like, what happened? Like, you good? Did so-and-so piss you off? Did so-and-so piss you off? And I'm like, you know he did. You no, know he pissed me off once again. Like, striked again. Like, literally. So, um, I'm telling her, like, yeah, he pissed me off again. She was like, girl, you need to leave him alone. And I'm just like, mm -hmm. I hear you. I hear you. Like, I, I understand. I definitely will take your words into consideration. Definitely. Um, when people tell me like to leave people alone, I be like thinking about it, like, hmm, y'all don't know why he talk to me. Y'all don't know how we go through things. Y'all don't know. <laughs> you don't know him how I know him. <laughs> That's how I was feeling in my head that day. She's like, you should just leave him alone. It's not that easy. It's not. I ain't gonna lie. So. No, I'm telling, I'm listening, like, mm-hmm, I got you, like, I hear you, like, I understand your concern and stuff, thank you for listening, thank you for being there and stuff like that, like, I really, truly appreciate you for listening, taking your time out to leave class to come to the bathroom to chill with me while I sit in this damn stall and do nothing, <laughs> so, she's like, you good, girl, anytime, anytime, is you going to your next class, I'm like, I'll probably do, I don't know, I probably don't, I ain't gonna lie, I don't know. It just depends on how I feel. I feel like I was just a normal human being going through shit. You feel me? Like, people go through shit. After she told me the little speech or whatever, she ended up leaving to go back to class because she had a damn bathroom pass, and I was just there for fun. So, um, she went back to class, and I just sat on the toilet and just scrolled on freaking Instagram and Facebook. I wasn't doing nothing, so I had so much time on my hands. So, I'm like, I'm not going to sit in this bathroom for real for that long because I was already in there for 30 minutes. So after that, I went straight downstairs to the first floor. I went to the gym and I was just chilling in there for a little minute because my next class was all the way on the third floor and I didn't want to go all the way on the third floor right now just to sit there. So I'm gonna just sit in the gym where I can see everybody and be around people because people makes me happy. So I'm sitting in the gym waiting on the um, bell ring, bell to ring. As I'm waiting on the bell to ring, Kaya, Aaliyah, and Camila end up coming ne coming up next to me and was just sitting next to me trying to bother me. Like, <laughs> I ain't gonna say they were trying to bother me, but they was just, they felt my energy was off. Three of them came up to me trying to make dance trillers and shit. So I'm like, yeah, I'll do a triller with y'all. We did some trillers and it was cool. Like, it brought my energy up. Like, okay, I'm having fun. And I'm like, hmm, let's not go to class. Go, let's go do something else. So I didn't go to class the next period either. They didn't either. We were just literally roaming the streets of um, our high school, literally. <laughs> so w since we roaming the streets, we ain't had nothing better to do. Snuck into people's lunchrooms, racing. We were just doing a whole bunch of 
unnecessary shit. So it's about the end of the school day and Destiny asked me to walk with her to the um, train station because I wasn't going straight to the train station. I was going to practice. So she asked me to walk with her to the train station and I'm like, yeah, I got you. Cool, cool, cool. So everybody else was going the opposite way. I'm walking with Destiny to the train station and um, she was telling me how her sister been, she feeling discouraged that her party not going to be turned, you know, like a lot of people come. So I'm like, oh, I kind of feel bad for the girl. Let me start being the party promoter. Destiny said she's just trying to get the word around to everybody so people can come and support her sister and stuff like that so i do got a history with her sister like her sister cool but it be certain times when her sister just be like get out of my house y'all i'm like i right, i start promoting her stuff put me on flyer i, I posted on my page i posted on facebook snapchat instagram you feel me i posted so that's like oh my god thank you dar you was the only person who said they wasn't gonna come or was thinking about it. like everybody else said they was gonna come and i'm like i hope dari come i don't want to just be everybody and not dari i hope dari come in and stuff like that and i'm like i was thinking about it when you told me but it was like i had a lot going on in my head at the moment so i couldn't list literally didn't care i ain't gonna lie but you telling me this now i'm gonna come you feel me i'm gonna come because you, you want your sister to have a good party you feel me so she sent me the flyer and she put me on a flyer i started to post it on my facebook instagram and snapchat so i'm posting it. It, it was going up on my page a lot of people was like they slide and they coming and stuff so i'm like bad i got people that's gonna come okay people gonna show up for destiny's sister even though a lot of people don't even know her okay boom let's fast forward to the day of the party um the day of the party let me tell y'all i wasn't even near home i was all the way in freaking the suburbs the day of this dang gone party i was with my mama all the way in the suburbs i was not home my mama was not feeling well and i didn't have a ride and i'm telling like destiny and the group chat i'm telling the group chat like y'all ain't got no ride i'm all the way in the suburbs anybody want to come get me or send me an uber or something like what y'all want to do because i can't make it if i don't get no ride duh so destiny was like how far are you in the suburbs girl how far i come get you so i sent him my location i was an hour away in like 30 minutes i was far as hell when we go this far she going for therapy or a weekly massage and sometimes i will go with her to get one but this time it wasn't even a massage this time i really feel like it was for her therapy but you know because she had broke her ankle a while back so um show her like i'm an hour and 30 minutes away how we gonna do this because i don't really got no way so destiny was like girl you so far you so far i i can't drive an hour and 30 minutes away like how why did you get that far like why are you out there and i'm like girl i'm out here for my mama right now but i figured something out just like hold on like go ahead and start the party but i get there you feel me so as my mama doing what she doing, I asked her, can I drive her car to the party? Because I ain't going to be there for that long. I'm going to just come and show my face and leave. She was like, yeah, you can drive the car to the party, but don't mess up my car. Put gas in it and make sure you're back here on time so I can leave. So I'm like, okay. Bet. I leave about uh, 8.20-ish. I don't know. I left. Let's say 8.20. I left about 8.20. Made it there like nine something. And when I got there, it was nobody there. Like, I'm not even going <laughs> to i'm not gonna say nobody was there but it was a few people there like our friend group was there camila wasn't there yet kaya wasn't there and Aaliyah wasn't there either who else wasn't there and trinity wasn't there that was another friend of our friend group them four wasn't there they wasn't there yet so i called them i'm like where y'all at like why y'all not here at the party they was like girl i didn't have a ride i overslept i forgot i had work i had this i had that so i'm like it's nine o'clock y'all can still make it y'all y'all can still make it i'm texting the group chat like y'all can still make it and they was like who could pick me up so i'm like bro i already didn't have a ride and i i came and the whole group chat supposed to be here but y'all not here and i showed up a whole hour and 30 minutes late when i was far as hell so i'm like bro i'll come pick you up so camila asked me to pick her up and kaya so kaya lives south and camila lives west so the party was out south so I'm finna go ahead and go west first and then go south. So I tell Camila like, yeah, I'm finna go pick you up and be on my way in like 30 minutes. So yeah, this was the first time I started driving. So I'm kind of new behind the wheel. Like this is not my first day, but it was my first time actually like driving an hour away and then driving to pick people up, having people in the car. It was just a lot of going on. So I'm like, hmm, I hope I don't have anxiety. So I'm on my way to Camila's house. I'm calling her like, Camila, I'm finna be on my way in like, five minutes come downstairs be ready like i don't be want i don't want to be sitting outside i don't i don't i'm gonna pull off so she was like all right girl i'm gonna be downstairs before you even pull off so i'm like i bet cool cool cool. i finally get to camilla house i pull around the corner 
Camila ass is not outside. So I'm I'm pissed because I already I'm on a time limit. I'm picking you up, picking her up, going back to the party, trying to be at the party. Then I got to go back to my mama house. I mean, back to my mama for an hour, 30 minutes away so she can leave on time. It's a lot. I'm doing a lot for y'all. So I'm like, Camila not downstairs. So I'm calling her phone. I'm calling, I'm calling, I'm calling. She not answering. So I'm like, all right, bro. She finna get left. So boom. Camila did not answer for five, ten minutes. I said, I'm gone. I text the group chat. I'm like, Camila, I'm gone. You waiting. I hit, You had me waiting for too long. I'm gone. So boom. Soon as I pull off, y'all. Soon as I pull off, like, I'm pulled off by the light, by the turn. Camila called my phone. I answered. I'm like, she like, Adari, I'm downstairs. I'm downstairs. Where you at? Where you at? I'm like, girl, I'm gone. Like, girl, I'm not finna turn around for you because you literally wasting my time. Had me coming all the way this way just to sit here and you not even here. Not you not even outside. You said you're gonna be outside before I even got here, but when I got here, you still in the house. You still in the house. No, like I don't got time for this. So I pulled off and I'm like, you can find, you get your Uber there or something else because you wasting my time. So I pull off. I tell her get her Uber. I don't care. I don't care because I'm pissed off. I drive to Kaya. I say, Kaya, I'm on your, I'm on the way. Be downstairs in like 30, we're going to say 30 minutes, 30 minutes. I'm mean, like, bro, you had me sitting down there for a long ass time. And you know what I had got going on. You know I can't be there, out here for this long. And I drove all the way out the way to come get you. You was not in the schedule to get. You feel me? If I should have known that when I was on my way to the party, I could have grabbed you on the way to the party. But no, you chose to get, wait till I get to the party to ask who could pick me up. But when I asked who could pick me up, nobody responded in the group chat. But that's me. So, so I go all the way to Kaya house. I go pick up Kaya. Kaya was outside when I got there. So it's me, me and Kaya in the car. So Kaya like, Darby, you really left Camila? You literally left Camila? I'm like, yes. Yeah. She had me sitting out there knowing I'm on a timeline. I can't be out here for this long. So something got to be. I told her to get an Uber because she wasn't even ready. She was in the shower, all type of stuff. She was putting on her clothes, all type of stuff. When she FaceTimed me, she didn't even have her wig on. She was just had her cap on. I was like, Darby, I'm outside. I'm outside. No. Fuck no. So <laughs> I drive to the party. I get back to the party. Okay, it's a lot of more people coming in now. Trinity end up Trinity ended up coming and Aaliyah ended up coming. And it's a lot of more people. It's a lot of boys, more than girls. So that's the problem. So it's really a kickback now. This fuck. We really chilling, sitting down, you know, chilling. Everybody talking and stuff. So Camila texts the group chat like, who could pick me up? Who could pick me up? 30 minutes later, y'all. Who could pick me up? She still wasn't ready. 30 minutes later. Now she asked for a ride. Who could pick up? So um, I didn't text the group chat back because I'm personally like I'm out of the equation. I'm not picking her up. So Destiny like she'll pick up. So Destiny went to go pick up Camilla and I told Destiny like be safe. Uh she probably had you out there sitting for a long time, but be safe this time, like for you. So she's like, All right, anybody wanna ride with me or anything? So I'm like, not me. I really don't wanna go. I'm trying to be here for the party, you feel me? So I think Kaya ended up getting in the car with her. I think, yeah, I think Kaya ended up getting a call with her. So Destiny's sister ended up coming out in the living room where the party was at, and she came sit by me. So she was like, girl, I thought a lot of more people was going to show up. I didn't know it was going to be like this. I thought people fucked with me. I thought people hanged with me, kicked it with me. And I'm like, Destiny's sister. I don't I didn't get her name, so I'm going to say Destiny's sister. I'm like, girl, it's okay. Like, everybody got these moments where people, you think people fuck with you, and then when it's time for you to throw something, they don't show up. Oh, hell no. Y'all y'all got the game fucked up. Like, ain't no way y'all finna not show up for me. And I show up for everything y'all got going on and go out my way. You feel me? But I can't speak for everybody because everybody not like that. But she said she show up for people, so she expected people to be there. But them expectations of motherfuckers, like, you can't expect motherfuckers to be there. And, like, mm -hmm. So I'm telling her, like, it's okay. We all got these moments when people just don't show up for us. That's why I cut a lot of people off. So all you got to do is just start cutting people off. And they'll feel that shit. They'll feel that shit. And y'all won't be talking no more. And you'll get friends who will show up for you. You feel me? I was telling her that. And then she started to, like, start drinking and stuff. She started drinking. Um, She took, like, two shots, two shots back to back. We started playing games. Um, It was like drinking games. She takes two shots, two shots back to back. Like she's taking more shots and shots. So Destiny, I call Destiny phone. I'm like, Destiny, where you at? Your sister almost drunk, girl. She falling over and stuff. Where you at? Destiny was like, girl, I'm stuck. I'm stuck at Camila's house. Like she's still not outside. So I'm like, girl, pull off. Pull the fuck. Pull off. Pull off. Pull. Listen to me. Pull off while you can. Because if you can't while you can, you're going to regret it. So um, yeah, I said pull off. She's like, no, she said she coming out. She said she coming out. So I'm like, okay. 
you have fun with that. But let me know when you're on your way back because your sister drunk. So, even though her sister was grown, it was just like, you know, nobody's there to, you know, siblings type shit. I hang up on the phone with Destiny and then I attend back to the kickback or whatever. So, we in a kickback and I'm making sure Destiny's sister, like, cool. Like, she was just falling all over the place. She was looking like sloppy or whatever. So, I'm like, hell no. Nah. Like, mm, you gotta be more. You, this your shit. You gotta be more like... Yeah, I pick her up. I put her like had her head on my shoulder and she was like, I want him. I want to play him. So she was like, she want to play this boy in a game. So it was like a man collar game, like the marbles and shit. So she said she wanted to play him. And I'm like, you sure you want to play him? She was like, yeah. And I, if I lose, I take four shots. And if he lose, he take five. So I'm like, girl, you want to take all them shots? You want to take all of them shots? She's like, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. This is my party. I brought all these people here. Ain't nobody do this for me. I did this for myself. I want to take four shots. I want to do four shots. I want to play that game. And I'm listening. I'm just like, oh. Type shit. Okay. You feel me? Y'all feeling the energy? So, I'm like, all right, go ahead and play the game with him. I'm going to let you go. I ain't can't hold you no more. So I, after I let her go, she started wobbling, 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 wobbling. So I'm like, girl, is you okay or not? It's like, do you need to sit down or not? So she's like, I'm good, girl. I'm good. Like, I can play this game. And I'm like, I bet. Cool. So I'm standing right next to them as they play the man collar game. So he wins. He wins. He wins the damn game. He didn't have to take no shots. But he was like, I split two shots with you. Me. And I'm like. I don't want to drink. I'm not here to drink. I'm literally here to just have fun. So he was like, please, let's split the shots. So I'm like, nah, I'm cool. You can split the shots with Destiny's sister because y'all two just played the game together. How about she take two, you take two? Just like that. So he was like, all right, I guess. So them two split two shots, and they did it like that. After Destiny's sister's second shot, she put her arm on me and was like, I'm so fucked up. I need to go to sleep. I need to go to sleep. So I'm like, okay, I'll put you in your room. She's like, no, don't put me in my room. I don't want to go to sleep. So I'm like, girl, what you want to do then? Like you say you want to go to sleep. What do you want to do? What do you want to do? What do you want to do? So she's like, I just want to be here. I just want to be here. And then she's like, where my sister? Where's my sister? So I'm like, calm down. Like she's panicking. Where's my sister? Where's my sister? Get the whole room looking at us. And I'm just like, oh my hell no. Oh hell no. So I'm like, she on her way back. She on her way back. She went to go get you some water. She was like, some water. I lied. I lied. She was like, some water. I got water in the refrigerator. I got water in the refrigerator. I don't need no water. So I'm like, girl. I don't have time for this. I'm finna go. I don't got time for this. Like, where's where's your people that, that be taking care of you when you drunk? Because you, you're older than me. I know you got some friends who take care of you. Nobody stepped up as a freaking leader, bro. Nobody stepped up. So, boom. Um, I FaceTime Destiny, and I'm like, girl, look at your sister. I put her in the camera. I'm like, girl, look at your sister. She was like, hell no. Why you let her get that fucked up? I'm like, girl. She's a grown ass lady. What are you asking me why I let her get that fucked? I am in my teenage years. She's in her 20s. I don't have no responsibility of trying to. I don't. I am not responsible for telling somebody how much they can and cannot drink. I don't know nobody's limit. Only the person that know their limit is that person that's drinking. Correct? Okay, then. So, I'm telling her that. And that seems like, okay, I'm on my way, though. I got Camila and Kaya with me. So, I'm on my way. So, I'm like, I bet. Hurry up. Hurry up. <sighs> So, at this point, um, Destiny's sister just literally, like, following me. Like, she on my shoulder just going where I'm going. So, I walked up to Trinity. Trinity in her own fucking world. Trinity, I don't even know what Trinity was doing. She was in her own world just there. So, I walk up to Trinity. I'm like, girl, you good? She's like, mm, I'm finna go. I'm like, dang, why? Like, she like, it's just not my type of party. Like, I ain't really having that much fun. I could have been doing my homework. I got a test tomorrow. All type of stuff. So, I'm like... For sure, Trinity, like, you finna leave now or you finna wait till Camila and Kaya and Destiny them get back. She was like, how far are they? She, I was like, they said they was pulling up. They on their way. She was like, uh, I'll wait on them. So, I'm like, okay, cool. So, um, boom. After that, my mama ended up calling me. And my mama called my phone. And I look at my phone I'm like, shit, my mama calling me. That means she ready. Oh, fuck, I'm finna have to leave. So, I see that she calling me and I answer. So I answer and I'm like, hello. She was like, Dari, where you at? And I'm like, I'm still at the party. You ready? She's like, yeah, I've been texting you. I'm ready. I'm ready. Come on, let's go. I'm ready to go home. I'm ready to go to sleep. So I'm like, okay, I'm on my way. I'm going to leave out in five minutes. I literally told her five minutes. Five minutes. So five minutes passed and I didn't leave out. Like five minutes passed. I didn't leave out. But Destiny, Camila, and Kaya ended up coming back. So they walking through the door. They got um, gangs like, hey, 
okay, you know, being lit as they come through the door. So I'm like, hey, y'all, hey, y'all. Camila go say some girl, I'm not talking to you. I said, girl, I don't give a fuck. I don't care. Like, you you, you need to respect a person's time when it comes to time when you know they on a time limit. They can't even be here for that long. That's what I said. And she was like, you knew I was getting ready. You knew it. All this and shit. And I'm like, no, you literally said when I get there, you're going to be outside already. And then you also had Destiny waiting. You was not ready. So that's that's on you. You know, you here now. So, um, hey, welcome. So once Destiny came in all the way, all the way through the door, she see her sister slumped on the couch. So once her sister slumped on the couch, she go tap her. She's like, you OK? You OK? Destiny's sister like rise up she's like sister where the fuck have you been and destiny was like girl i went to go get camila like that's how destiny talking like girl i went to go get camila her sister over yelling she's like girl you missed the whole party like drunk yelling you missed the whole party i can't blame you miss my party you not real you cut off you cut off and destiny was like girl i'm here like i helped you set the stuff up like what do you mean like i'm what do you mean i wasn't here to support you You know like what what do you mean <laughs> what do you mean sir i mean ma'am <laughs> that's me sister like you know what i'm talking about you was gone all day when reality she was gone for like an hour an hour at least so you was gone the whole day i party without you i'm drunk without you you're not a real sister man this is the older sister talking so i'm looking at her as she talking to destiny like that and i'm just like destiny it's time for your sister to go to bed bro she's clearly fucked up like it's time for her to go to bed so she was like she grown she gonna do what she want i'm finna leave though so i'm like you finna leave you just got back you just got, you just got back so i'm like you just got back she's like yeah my sister doing so much i don't like when she act like this so i'm finna leave so i'm like damn i mean Shit, we all from leaving this motherfucker then. I already got to go pick up my mama. I told my mama like 10 minutes ago I was leaving out. So, it is what it is. We can all leave. So, Destiny like, yeah, I'm probably finna leave. So, she said that about three times. So, Destiny's sister like, you said you finna leave. You said you finna leave. What you leaving for? Why you can't stay? Why you can't stay? So, Destiny's sister like, you know what? Everybody could get the fuck out. Everybody could fucking leave. And I'm looking at her like, damn, why the fuck is she acting this way? Like, I get you the only one really fuck up for real, but like, ma'am, ma'am, you are older than most of us at this party, ma'am. So she was like, everybody can fucking leave, like everybody can go. So everybody in the party started smacking their lips, cause I guess they was just having fun or whatever. Like, I was just babysitting the whole fucking time, so I don't even know what the fun looked like. Everybody started smacking their lips. Everybody like, man, I ain't wanna be here anyway. Like saying little smirks, sad comments like that. So I'm like, no way she putting us out. She like, yeah, I'm I'm telling y'all to leave. Like, I'm telling y'all to leave. So I ain't waste no time. I ain't gonna lie. I left. I left the dang on party. Quick, fast, in a freaking hurry. Um, Destiny ended up taking Camilla and um Kaya home because it was just like I couldn't take them home. I already had to get back to my mama. So I left in a heartbeat because I wasn't here to like beg nobody for me to stay or let the party go on. I didn't. I really didn't give two fucks. So I left. I left the party. I'm like, bye, y'all. See y'all later. I got to get my mama. So I got back on the road, driving back an hour and 30 minutes to go get my mama. I go get my mama. She was like, Darby, what took you so long? What took you so long? I'm like, mm, it was traffic. Like, I, I couldn't get here in time. Sorry. It was a lot of traffic. So she was like, traffic my ass. Traffic my ass. So I'm like, yeah. So she get in the car. She get in the driver's seat. I get back in. The, I get in the passenger seat. I get an incoming call from Destiny. So Destiny's like, "Girl, I'm sorry about that. Like, I won't ever have nobody promote her party ever again. She was just sloppy drunk. She really did the most tonight. I really wasn't fucking with her. I'm not talking to her no more after this. I'm not helping her do nothing else after this because this how she act when she drunk, and I don't be liking that. Like, why would she tell me I'm not her sister for real? Like, I don't support her when I literally helped her do the whole freaking party. I put the word out for her, all type of stuff, and I'm just like, girl, you gotta accept when people don't appreciate." you that much and just got you there for what you can do like it's no reason she was she should say that but she was drunk but that's not an excuse um that's really how she felt in the moment because you wasn't there for an hour or so but it, the only reason you wasn't there was because camila wasn't ready literally like that's the only reason you wasn't there but that you know that you can't beat yourself up about that because like <sighs> 
shit happens. She'll be she'll be okay tomorrow. She gonna regret what she said tomorrow when she noticed her friends didn't come and your friends did. You feel me? She's gonna be like, damn, I need to keep my sister around. Her friends show up for her. I gotta start angry. Yeah, that's how it's gonna really be. But that's it for today's story time. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn your post notifications on for my next story time. And thank y'all for watching. I love y'all. Go follow all my social medias at I am underscore Dari Takala and Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter, and TikTok, Adari Takala.